Welcome back. It's Jennifer again. And today I will try to create a toothbrush holder, a partner for the jewelry holder or jewelry tray that I made. I will use the same napkin. So it's a pair. We'll be using the same napkin to match the jewelry tray. I have cut out the napkin. I turned the pieces and then we'll just get the top layer of the napkin. Then we will use brush. We will use again Mod Podge and our top coat to seal our project the glossy finish varnish While it's drying, I'm gonna take out the excess in the bottom using my sandpaper. Let dry and then we will apply another mud layer of mud patch on top after drying. Now it's all dry and I started to put the second layer of mud patch. Now that it's all dry, we're ready to apply the first layer of varnish.
Okay, first layer of varnish, leave it to dry, and then we'll come back for the second layer. First layer of varnish all dry, and now I'll add the final layer or the second layer of varnish. Since this piece will be by the sink, I'll apply three layers of varnish. So, because it might get wet a bit, and then to protect it, I'll apply three layers of varnish. second layer I let it dry and apply the third layer and after it gets dry it will be all okay for use so you can enjoy your new and handmade toothbrush holder or makeup brush holder or you can use it for anything or pencils or for q-tips so it's all drying right now and we'll apply a last layer I'll be applying a third layer of varnish to protect this from wet this is the final layer of varnish that I'm putting on this one. There you go. Third layer of varnish done. That's my final layer. And then let it dry and your brush holder is ready for use now I have a perfect pair of jewelry tray or jewelry holder and a makeup brush or toothbrush holder thank you for watching and See you on my next video. It's Jennifer here. Bye.